know what I'm saying? If that, that's what you think the people want to see? You you chewing on honeycombs while we trying to record a podcast? Or what you want to do? I want to be me. Uh, you can be you, but God damn, Not eat honeycombs. People don't want to see you eat honeycombs while you're trying to talk to them. Um, I mean, what I'm looking. All right, well we recording, so how you gonna start? How you gonna start off your podcast? What's up, yo? My name is Key. Man, listen, man. <laughs> Ooh, boy. <laughs> this I'm this is why I get married. <laughs> I'm feeling red face, man. You know what I'm saying? This is my wife, Keisha. You okay. know what I mean? You know, she say she go by Key because she the Key and all I that. Am. And like she said, man, this is why I get married, man. This is why did the I get married. The motherfucking podcast. Why? Bitch. Why did I get married? Huh? Motherfucker. Why the fuck did I get married? <laughs> so this is what we talking about, man. This is what we doing. You know what I mean? This is something that we wanted to set out to do. Shouts to the inspirations. The yes. many, many great podcast people that came before us and all that old good hey, shit. They can do it. We can do it. You right? know what I'm saying? So, you know, we got a lot of shit to talk about. You know. And, you know, most of us going to deal with why did I get married? Yeah, you just know, being married. You know, first, first show, first topic. Why did I get married? She mean that shit, too. She... <laughs> You really don't know why. I but know why. Anyway, like, um, man, listen, man, we we gonna have a, a nice adventure, you know, with y'all. We trying to, you know, build our fan base, yes. you know, our people, our followers, the people that's gonna be fucking with us. Let's talk about some real shit. You know what I mean? Unsugarcoated. Not oh, sugarcoated stank. at all. Not sugarcoated at Might all. Might even smell. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> A lot of shit going on in the world, so we can't sugarcoat nothing. Motherfuckers see everything, they find out everything, so there's no reason for us to sugarcoat a motherfucking thing, you hear me? So with that being said, you know, before we get into this first topic of why did I get married, let me let me ask you a question, babe. You know, is is this is this podcast shit, you know what I mean, something you going to take serious or like, you know what I mean, is we like what the fuck like is this like, you know what I mean, we like we recording a podcast right now. So Right, and this is what I asked for. And yes, I'm going to take it serious. Now. So why you That's come the on the first you, question like, be why you come on like on set like, chewing fucking honeycombs and shit like I didn't know you was hitting the play button at first. Man, man, luckily this is just like a test run. For the first episode, and he not said, in front of a big no, ass No, let me just say this though. He said, um, he said, I'm going to smoke weed. So, oh, like, no, what's no. wrong with me eating honeycombs? Like, nah, I'm not talking good. about there's nothing wrong with you eating honeycombs. I'm talking about the way you was smacking them motherfuckers, like, 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 like it was ice or something. You like, mm, 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 mm. how you gonna talk to the people? Then you no, I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna talk with the honeycombs in my mouth. I'm digest them first. Dang. They're gone. That is so motherfucking crazy, man. Speaking of weed, man. Speaking of motherfucking weed. This, I don't want to call them no names, but, you know, uh, Joe Biden, the, this president that, you know, you, you elected him. You, yeah, I mean, it's not people's business for You that. voted for it's that. Not people's business for that. You know what I'm saying? He's saying that any transaction over $600 from the American people, like, you know, people that spend money like me. You know, you spend money, you know what I mean? I do. So any transaction over $600 is going to be reported to the IRS. Now, mind you, this is this is something that came from being $9,999. Anything over $10,000 is reported to the IRS. Mm -mm. Now they bringing it down to six hundred dollars. That's easy to me, and you know, there's three people you don't want to mess with. You know why they doing that? That's the I, the R, and the S. Hey look, <laughs> hey look, man. I, hmm. I read that shit early. I said, well, damn, like you know, I just start, I just start thinking about my weed man. He gonna lose a lot of motherfucking money because, you know, my transactions with him is bigger than six hundred dollars. I smoke more than six hundred dollars worth of weed. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So I got to figure this shit out. You know what I mean? Mm. 
Jesus. But see, that just means it's a job. What kind of job? What are you talking about? <laughs> you gotta report it. <laughs> what are you talking about? What? What are you talking about? Are you saying it's like a, like, you know, he has to report it or you have to report no, it? No, what I'm saying is, say if I, say if I want, you know how you, you know how motherfucker uses cash app, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes it get, get a little, you know, a little, yeah. little, little something or whatever. And and that's a transaction. That's mm -hmm. a banking transaction. Mm -hmm. So if that should say seven fifty or or eight, you know, eight fifty, then it's getting reported. You know, usually, you know, who's it getting reported on whose behalf? The IRS. Yeah, that's who it's being reported to. But who who's what part of the transaction do you think is going to be affected? The transaction not going to be affected. What I'm saying is they monitoring your money moves. Oh. Do that anyway. Just don't tell you about it. Anyway, man, listen, man. Fuck the IRS. <laughs> I don't mess with them. I mean, as long as you pay them, motherfuckers, you can say fuck them, fuck them. You right. know what I mean? I pay. I pay my employee taxes. I pay my personal taxes. My wife pay taxes. Man, fuck the IRS. Yeah, I fuck. You know what I mean? You pay. You you do what the fuck you supposed to do. Fuck them. Fuck them. Fuck all of them. You know what I'm saying? But anyway. You know, when you when you get married, you know, them taxes they, they come they become a different story. You know what I'm saying? We you know, I don't know how that shit work, but you know, they do a whole bunch of crazy bullshit, you know, to both parties once you get married, you know what I'm saying? Well once you collide them. Once you collide your taxes. Yeah, that shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? But listen, man, fuck all that. Why'd you get married, babe? Fuck all that. Why did you get married? Why did I get married? Here. All right. Because it's of saying, all, let me just say that there's a statement that says a lot of husbands want wives but don't really want to be a husband. Can you elaborate on that while you answer that question? Why did you get married? You you want me to speak for other niggas? I want to know how true you think that is. I don't need you to speak so for say other that again. niggas. There was a statement or a post that I read, and it says a lot of men, a lot of men want wives, but they don't want to be husbands. Well, I mean, I can't really, I, I, I don't know, because all, all the all the real men, you know, that I do know, if they get married, that's what they want to do. You know, what I'm saying they want to be a husband. They want to be, you know, somebody that's committed, and and you know, uh, you know, a motherfucking husband. Uh, you know why did you get married? See, I'm a gentleman. So I let ladies go first. So you got to answer that question. No, you got to answer that question. Why did you get married? Why did you get married? You a lady. You a lady. But I go first. You got to go first. You a lady. I'm gonna go first just because I'm going to go first. I'm not gonna sit here and go back and forth. Because one thing about him is I know him, and one thing I know is that we'll go back and forth about who's gonna go first, just so he could be right and. He Why really will have did you me get married? go first. So I'm going to go first. Tell me. I got married because that's marriage is for me. I know marriage is for me. Um, I've had the best of both worlds, of course. I've been single and I've been married. And this is not the first time I've been married. This um, is the first time you've been married? No, this is the first time. <laughs> what the fuck? This is not the first time I've been married. What? But what that's you, why oh, wait, this wait, wait, time... Rewind. What he should be happy because... Babe, he you just said this ain't the first time you was married. Rewind that shit. Why? It's like, nah, I know an old husband. Good, like, why? You know good dude. I'm a, I'm I a, am a relationship <laughs> kind of sore. That's what I want. I don't want to be single. I don't want to uh, have different this and different that around. I like solid shit. That's how I rock. You know what I'm saying? Um... He should be happy that this is the second marriage because cause I'm polished a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I still make mistakes. Oh. Hold on, I'm polished So you though. want me to be I happy because another nigga broke you in? Broke me in? You said polished? I'm polished what? when it comes to being a wife. I know what mistakes I made. You don't get those mistakes. Trust me because I learned from my mistakes. I got married because marriage is for me. I totally respect marriage. I believe that... Um, just being connected to one in a solid sense 
under whatever God you guys believe in or however you guys decide to be married. It, it just creates um, stability. I, I believe that your life gets better. You know what I'm saying? Because you do things differently. You do things with a conscience. You're doing things in a guided way because you took vows now. You know what I'm saying? You're not just out here. I like rules and regulations because I don't want to run astray. Just how I got sit. You know what I'm saying? So That's let it. me ask you this. You you said you said I should be happy because because you polished. Like, no, I want you niggas to don't. <coughs> I want you to answer. When you, were married. you knew that I was married before when you niggas asked to marry me. So that's not don't a surprise. Take lightly to thinking about another nigga polishing his wife. Like you using the crazy words. You're being words. very I just, immature. I just need to know what you meant by I meant by polish, polish meaning really, like I've been married know before. I made all I made, made a polish. lot of mistakes in that marriage. He warmed you up like what? I made a lot of mistakes in that marriage that I would never make in this one because man, I learned from look, my mistake. Man, That's I what I mean. My father. So I got an experienced wife? You got an experienced wife. I even know when I'm doing things wrong. Why did you get married? <laughs> I don't know why the fuck I got married. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, shit. I don't know why the fuck I got married. Like, if I say I'm going to let his He's not paying me no attention. I'm going to let these clothes pile up for a month. It's going to get some type of attention, even if it's negative. Like, hey, wait, what's up? Why, 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 why are you not doing the laundry? Why should I do laundry when I, I haven't seen you? You know what I'm saying? It, it makes, it, that's what I mean by I know when I'm doing things wrong. Little stuff like that. You know? So, but that's, that's any, that's any, that's even a little... You know, little, know that little that's, uh, that's like a, a little virgin little girlfriend knows if she's doing something wrong. I'm saying a lot you of things. Gotta have, like, I mean, I'm trying to understand this. But why did you get married? Because you're not, you sound like you're dancing. You, he don't know. He really don't. He's one of the men. I'm going to tell you why. He's just married. one of the whites. So I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you. Though, Is that why? Yeah. I'm going to tell you why I got married. Because I know what the fuck I want. You know what I'm saying? Mm. That's it. There's nothing else. There's no long drawn out speech. It's because I know what the fuck I want. And you want it to be married? I wanted to be married to you. Oh. I didn't never ask nobody else in my motherfucking life to marry me. I got motherfucking... Free baby mothers. Never asked none of them to marry me. Uh, I got motherfucking a girl tied on my arm that I ain't got no kids by. That was his first love, but he didn't and ask. Never her. asked her to marry me. I got married because I know what the fuck I wanted. That's what's up. You know what I'm saying? But now that I'm married... <laughs> I don't fucking know. <laughs> he don't know why he got married. <laughs> oh man, listen. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you though, like because we don't know. We don't. We probably know besides besides our parents. Like as far as our peers, I think we only know personally one other married couple in our whole circle right mm -hmm. i would say we only know one but let me think but we know people that have married. been married who who um, who who's married babe mm -hmm. couple wise that we kick it with that right now no, forever, for the last 10 years since we've been together, who's been married um, around us? Wasn't Keith married before? Keith was div divorced way before you even knew Keith. But he was married. No, I'm talking about people that we hung out with. Hash. Okay, all right. There okay. we go. So two, I could think of two other married couples. Nobody else. 
Ding, ding, doom, 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 doom. Mm. Nobody else, right? And I say that to say, what's the hold up? Like, did we do something wrong? Why did we get married? Did we do something wrong here? Like right. what? Like I like I got a lot of we got a lot of good good friends that we go out with, we party with, we chill with, we travel with. They're not married. Nobody's married. Oh, you know who else is oh. married? Um, Joe and her husband, Cash, Bradley, Cash, his sister and brother. Been, well, yeah, like hey, we, we just met them. Couple. We just met them. We just met them. We just met them. <laughs> we just met them, but they are married. But my point is this. Why the fuck did I get married? You know, through these episodes, y'all going to help us figure it out. Because we, we claim we know, but we want y'all to I help know us figure why I it got out. Married. You, she claims she know why the she got married. The question is, why did I get married to him? I know why I got married. All right, so if that's the question, why the fuck you get married to me? Then? That's not what you asked me. All right, well, I'm going to ask you that then. I married him because I saw in him what he probably don't even see himself. It's like, he's a great person. You guys probably know him as, no, you guys probably get to see him as a great person because he's he's greater. He's the greatest, 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 greatest <coughs> friend ever. He's a very great friend. You know what I'm saying? Um, That's sarcasm or... <laughs> So what I'm no, saying no, no, no. is what, he what has a mean, beautiful though, side to him. And when I met him, that's what got me. We did everything fast. Like, I was pregnant twice, you know what I'm saying? Right on um, Lost moved, my first baby. Moved, moved straight to Atlanta within a year. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm, we were and fucking heavy, we too. We were just moving. That was back when I was giving it up. Uh, Crazy. Yeah. After the first one was lost, we was first, like, let's have another one. Like, you know what I'm saying? So my son, like she... First nine fucking... What? I got you pregnant. I know I first nine weeks I was with you, I got you knocked up. That's dirty. For real, for real. We really should have still been she using protection. But me. let me tell you what else I he did. I was a player, too. But let me tell you what else he did Listen, that really, really got she, me, y'all. He told me, he said, I'm going of... to the clinic. He said, I'm going to the clinic because... Remember you went to Broad Street Clinic? You said, I'm going to the clinic because I want to... <laughs> Raw, you know what I'm saying, and I want to make sure everything's straight. That shit meant a lot to me. Yeah, because yeah, you gotta yeah. ask niggas like, go get checked yeah, out, man. Go get yeah. a clean bill of health for yeah, you. Cause I like you eating pussy. Ask them. I, like I love eating pussy. You know what I'm saying, and and the thing about it, I'm I, like like sure, like like I never had suspicion, you know, or anything like that. But see, if I'm gonna take you personal, personal, let's get a clean bill of health. I need that bill of health. And so then I, I never dated I, I never dated you I dated a man with children. <laughs> and he was the first guy that I decided to date with a child. He he happened right before I, I stopped it. He he had he came along right when I stopped that boundary. And I and, and he said he had four daughters and at first it was just like ill because I don't want to deal with other women. But she I couldn't don't. but she couldn't say ill. You wanna know why? She had four daughters too. That's what was decent. And I just wanted to give it a try. And from day one, I swear like like the after like the second week of us spending time, we was like going to get his you know, children because they mattered. And even if we wasn't going to get them, we was going to do something for them. It's just that they mattered. That meant a lot to me. Um, that meant a lot. That meant a lot. So so You don't always see that. He had great qualities. And that and, um, and, and, and and all that quality shit she's talking about, I mean, I was raised by my grandma. So that shit come from grandma, you know. But I had to go through a whole lot of shit. You know what I mean? She she trying to make it seem all, you know, well and good. Oh yeah, I married him because he's this great guy, he's this person. It was. It was nothing's easy. We've been going through shit since day one. Like, come on, Neil. If you're going yeah, to keep it a being, I, like, that's what I'm saying. So don't be trying to make it seem like it's just loving. Yeah, but at lullaby, the same token, at the same token, the fucking, question is, uh, if he wasn't uh, going through shit with me, he'd still be going through shit. Book. What? what? Right? Mm -hmm. With somebody. And that's what I was telling my man today. I told my man Rob today. I said, you know what? If you don't get married. You're going to have to go through 
50 times the shit that you gonna go through if you don't, if you do, if that makes sense. I know a nigga right now who, who got paint through on his car, uh, who got, who got motherfucking, uh, a baby blamed on him that wasn't his, mm. uh, cops called on him, mm. uh, uh, busting a motherfucking kneecap with a baseball bat, mm. and guess what? It, these are four different bitches that 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 this happened to him by. That's so, just too much. So you know, so you know, it's see, a, that's the thing. I used to like being playing the field, but I get feelings like I can't be a slut because I have a soft heart. I slut. mean, I know how to get it to be a slut though. That's my job. I can't can be an all around the ways slut. I, I could be a slut I, for I, him. I know, I know how to do that. But anyway, listen, we don't know. I don't I, like. I tried not to preach this marriage shit to nobody because look, man, this shit is no joke. It's this shit is work. no joke. All these little podcast motherfuckers that be out here. Oh, this is the loving way to do this, and you'll get by by holding hands. And meditating and together. Fake. That's fake. I don't know who the fuck you married to. I mean, we do get those moments, but it's not like that. It's not. I mean, of course you get little loving moments. I mean, it's worse. But this shit is this shit is the real deal. This shit is concrete. Lord. It's so hard to manage concrete. <laughs> but it's still hard. It's but hard. it's so hard. My fucking, my fucking spit on it, piss on it, Ooh. fucking uh, spill shit on it, crack it. Mm. How Step shit, on how it. How the shit can happen to concrete, but it stay, Walk on it stay it. solid. Pain, stay hard. Change it up a little bit. It never turns back to liquid. So that's hard to manage. You know what I'm saying? I don't never try to play like, you know, shit. Like he perfect. Like perfect, you know. But one thing I do know, and even if it ain't why I got married, one thing I do know is why I stay married. You hear me? You hear me? Mm -hmm. Listen, it's a lot of shit that it's we're going to talk to y'all about. We're going to have special guests. We're going to have our kids as special yeah. guests. they going to love it. Listen, man. This is just like a little pilot it's episode for y'all, man. We're going to have a dope-ass brand new background in November when we y'all yeah. see us again. We're going to talk about so many dope topics. We're going to get raw. We're going to have married couples as guests, yep. famous married couples as guests, people yep. that y'all see on TV all the time. We're going to have... That's going to get real with us. Different type of appearances, and we're going to also travel to different places and bring you the live life of With red it. and k you hear me it should this be k and red though because i've heard that k comes red before i think our... red and key sound better it's k and red i think red and key sound better though man. because k comes before r nah but but red and key you gotta think about the you gotta think about the you know what i mean the marketing aspect People know me. And people know me too. Yeah, just regular people know me. So the fuck what? Regular people is everything. All right, well, we're going to see, man. Red and key. So even if it's key and red. Or key and red. We're going to let y'all decide. <laughs>